Okay, let's do a kind of a guided meditation on accessing uh, the eternal now. So the first thing to, to recognize when realizing and recognizing the eternal now is that to recognize the eternal now, one has to let go of identification with anything which is limited. So, the first thing to be aware of is, are, is one aware of anything which is constricted or limited right now? Is there any awareness of the body? Is there any awareness of sensations in the body? Is there any awareness of thoughts? Is there any awareness of images? Is there any awareness of tightnesses or stresses? Is there an awareness of the, of the space that the body is occupying? Is there any awareness of location? Now all of these are, if one is aware of them, then there is the, that which is aware of them, which cannot be them. Just like if one is aware of the body, one cannot be the body. There has to be a greater awareness that is aware of the body, which is not the body. If one is aware of thoughts, one is not the thoughts. There has to be a greater awareness which is witnessing, or in which the thoughts are experienced, which is greater than the thoughts. If one is aware of the length or circumference of the body, then there has to be a greater awareness of the body. Excuse me. So, if, um, if there are thoughts, what is the greater awareness in which there are thoughts? So as you do this, strip it back like layers of an onion. What's aware of the body and, not, and also what is aware of the body and the thoughts? And what is the awareness of the body, the thoughts, the images and the sensations? Now, as you're doing this, you're going deeper and deeper in. It's just like what St. Francis said. What you're looking for is where you're looking from. And the place of looking from, the ultimate place in looking from, is that in which everything else is within it. But it, there is nothing else that can be within that. So a metaphor would be like, thoughts are like clouds, the body is like a cloud, the feelings within the body are like clouds. So what is, the gr what is the greatest awareness in which all these clouds are within, but in which nothing else can be within? And that would be the sky. So recognize now, what are you? Are you a cloud or are you the sky? Are you a thought passing along or are you the sky in which the thoughts pass along? Are you the body, or are you the sky in which the body is within it? Now as you keep taking it back, you'll start to recognize a greater and greater awareness. The greater awareness occurs as one is releasing being that which is smaller. The more you release the things which are smaller, the greater you become. And the greater you become, the more expansive you become. And the more expansive you become, it's, more, it's like the limits start to disappear, you become more limitless. So as you release the identification in thoughts, then you become timeless. As you release the identification in the body, you become bodiless. As you release the identification with images, you become imageless. And as you release your identification with any form of limited location, you become locationless. So are you recognizing now that which is beyond location, beyond time, beyond limits, beyond body and beyond thoughts? 
And if you're beyond all of those things, are you beyond all, all that can constrict or limit you? If you're recognizing that limitless eternal space, then allow yourself to rest in the eternal. And as the eternal, do not allow yourself to constrict or identify into that which is limited. And just allow this presence to be the source of what you are through the rest of the day.